Tonight, two children are recovering after being hit by a van this afternoon in Pensacola. This happened right as school ended for the day. Cody Long was on the scene then, and he's live now after talking to police and a witness. Cody? That's right, Pete. Just like you said, this happened right around uh, the time that school let out here at East Hill Academy behind me. This is a special school for students with autism, and there was a group of students. They were walking here across Garden Street into this crosswalk when a van came by and hit two of the girls. It's horrible. It's horrible. Anybody that gets hit by a car, but a child is even worse. Deborah Jacobs was picking up her great niece at East Hill Academy Tuesday afternoon when she heard a van plow into a group of girls who were crossing Garden Street. My great niece was getting in the car and I heard the thud and the screaming and I knew exactly what happened. There were four or five students who were crossing Garden near Donaldson Street. Two of the girls were hit a seventh and ninth grader. Where you see that police cruiser is, there was a car stopped in traffic. They were attempting to cross the crosswalk right there in front of that car that was stopped. The vehicle, this van you see here, was not able to see those kids and struck two of them. Some parents say there's a ton of traffic at two o'clock in the afternoon every weekday. While Deborah says the school does a lot to keep the kids safe here on the property, Maybe more should be done for the ones who are crossing this busy street. Provisions need to be made to make it safely to go across. It, it's hard to cross the street as an adult. I can't imagine crossing it as a child. And we're told that the driver is not being charged and that he was cooperative with police today. Those girls were taken to a local hospital, and the good news here is that they have non-life-threatening injuries. Reporting live in Pensacola, Cody Long, WKRG News 5.